My wife cheated on me with her girlfriend and her husband. Last weekend my wife, 50, went out for drinks and dinner with her best friend. This was a planned dinner and not out of the ordinary. She looked amazing all dressed up. She was going to take the night off from dialysis, which is a welcome treat for her. The plan was for her to go to dinner and then go back to her friend's house for a while and then come home. They went out to dinner but it took longer than expected, which pushed back the time she was going to come home. I told her that maybe she should spend the night and I could bring her clothes or bring her home and we could pick up the car the next day. She said she had some stuff in the car. I have clean gym clothes which would work in a pinch. They took an Uber into the city had dinner and drinks and took an Uber back to her friend's house. We stayed in communication all evening and she sent photos. We chatted and I told her good night and we said we loved each other. She did have a few drinks and I could tell she was a bit tipsy. She comes home the next day in the afternoon, immediately came in, showered and put the clothes in the washing machine. I found it a little unusual because I generally do the laundry and she didn't wash anything else. She said she spilled something on my shirt and she wanted to clean it so I wouldn't be mad. After the shower she went down and pretty much slept until late in the evening. Nothing seemed out of the ordinary, she is always tired and not doing a treatment compounds her tiredness. The next day she said that we needed to talk. She started crying and told me that her night out didn't go as planned. She said that once they got back to her girlfriend's house, they had some more drinks and did some substances. Which I thought was Zaza. It turns out I was way off. She said that they did do some Zaza, had some coke and maybe some hard stuff. I was floored when she said coke and hard stuff. Until recently, she never did Zaza or edibles. I assumed she was crying because of the substances. She continued to say that her friend and her were dancing and listening to music. She said that when everything kicked in she was having a really good time. She said that they started talking about husbands and lovemaking and things they wanted to experience. She said that they were just goofing around and her friend kissed her. Never in a million years would I have expected her to kiss another woman. She had another friend that wanted to have a three-way with my wife and me. My wife said she would never be with another woman with or without me. I was okay. It didn't bother me and I actually had a little smile. She said it gets worse. She said that she was turned on by the kissing and touching, she said that things went further. Now she had me curious. I was more mad that she did substances just because she is on dialysis. She said that things moved to the bedroom and that her friend's husband was there watching the whole thing unfold. Once they moved into the bedroom the husband went from a viewer to a participant. She said that the husband was focused on only his wife but then the wife started to put the husband's hand on my wife. My wife said that she pushed his hand away but her friend was persistent. I asked why she didn't stop and call me. She said that she felt like she was watching someone else's life unfold. She said she felt fairly helpless. She said that her friend and her husband started kissing her and touching her and it felt amazing. Like fireworks going off inside her. We have been together in each other's only partners for 28 years. She basically admitted to making love with her friend and the husband. She said that they would stop and cuddle and then continue. Then my wife made love with the husband while her friend laid there passed out. Unprotected intimacy. They made love a couple of times and the husband went and slept in the spare bedroom after. When everyone woke up and sobered up in the morning is when the regret kicked in. The wife had no idea that my wife made love with her husband without her participation. My wife said that the couple had never done anything like this before and it wasn't planned. I call bull crap on her friends. Why would they have hard substances if they didn't like to party somewhat? My wife has been friends with her friend for almost 30 years. We've been out with them hundreds of times. They have never given any indication of any of this. I could have handled some of this but I can't handle it all. I left her there and stayed in a hotel for a couple of days. She called me hundreds of times and left texts. She started saying she was remorseful and blamed it on the substances and drinking. She said that she feels powerless in life with needing a kidney transplant and having to do dialysis every day. I told her that I partly understood but she betrayed me and threw away our life together. Her friend then started calling me begging me to forgive my wife. She said that none of this was planned and that it just happened. She said that her and her husband regret the whole night. I went and met my wife. I asked her to tell me all the details. She was crying and seemed remorseful and said she would do anything to make it up to me. I started pressing her about the love making with the husband. The more I pressed the more details she provided, the more I knew she really enjoyed it. She said her friend would be open to having a three-way with me and her to right the wrong. I don't think I could bring myself to following through with it. I'm done with her and I want to file for divorce. I meet with a lawyer next week. I'm not sure where she would live after all this. She doesn't work and has end-stage kidney disease. We have a house that we have to sell. She would probably get some of the proceeds and maybe some alimony. We have a college-age child together. I feel gutted.